Hello and welcome to Toman Brass in Wins History Edition. I'm Felix and today we're taking a little excursion into brass history. So take your pen and paper and take notes. A lot of times I get asked, hey, I know that the instrument you're playing here is a trumpet, but what about this other thing with the bigger bell? What is that? Let me introduce you to the flugelhorn. What is it, where does it come from and how is it used? The flugelhorn is a brass instrument that belongs to the bugle family and is similar in structure and playing style to the cornet and trumpet. It is characterized by its conical bore, which widens continuously from the mouthpiece to the bell. This design gives the flugelhorn its distinctive, soft and full sound. The origins of the flugelhorn can be traced back to the 18th century. It evolved from the hunting horns and the so-called signal horns used in the military to transmit comments. The term flugelhorn comes from the German word flügel, meaning flank. Originally, the instrument was used to signal between the flanks of a military formation. A significant milestone in the development of the flugelhorn was the invention of the valve system in the early 19th century. German musicians and instrument makers Heinrich Stölzel and Friedrich Blümel independently invented valves that made brass instruments chromatic. This greatly expanded the musical range of the flugelhorn, allowing for greater flexibility and expressiveness. Compared to a standard trumpet, the mouthpiece is typically deeper and wider than that of a trumpet, contributing to the softer sound. The body has a conical bore, making the sound fuller and less piercing than that of a trumpet, which has a cylindrical bore. The valves are usually piston valves, but there are also flugelhorns with rotary valves. Today, the flugelhorn is present in various music genres, particularly in brass band, jazz and classical music. In brass bands and brass ensembles, the flugelhorn plays a significant role. It is often used for melodic lines and as a solo instrument because its sound is softer and more expressive than that of a trumpet. It is a central instrument in traditional brass band music, such as alpine folk music. In jazz, the flugelhorn has secured a firm place especially to its warm, soft sound, which is well suited for lyrical solos. Famous jazz musicians like Miles Davis, Art Farmer and Chuck Mangione have used the flugelhorn in their recordings, contributing to its popularity. Davis' album Miles Ahead and Sketches of Spain are outstanding examples of the use of the flugelhorn in jazz.
classical music, the flugelhorn is less frequently used, but it still has its place in some orchestral works and chamber music ensembles. Composers of the 20th and 21st centuries have incorporated the flugelhorn into their scores to utilize the instrument's unique sound. Works by composers like Igor Stravinsky and Dmitry Shostakovich include parts for the flugelhorn. The flugelhorn is a versatile brass instrument with a rich history and unique sound. It evolved from military signal horns and is now found in many music genres, particularly standing out in brass band music and jazz. Its ability to produce both soft and powerful tones makes it a popular instrument for musicians worldwide. The continuous development of the instrument and its integration into various musical styles underscore its significance and popularity. I hope you could take away some useful information in case you didn't know already. Let us know in the comments if you would like to see more videos like this on our channel. Speaking of, feel free to like and subscribe to Toman Brass and Wins and I hope to see you next time.